What is up, party people? Welcome to Minneapolis, Minnesota. And brr, is it cold in Minneapolis in February. And look who it is. It's my wife, Jenny. Hi. She came for a visit. Minneapolis is the cultural hub for the Midwest, basically anywhere within six hours of here. So if a big tour is coming through the Midwest but isn't making a whole lot of stops, it probably comes here. It's also where the Mighty Ducks franchise was filmed. The location of the incredible Mall of America, which we did not have time to check out because they're not open on Sundays. That's not true. They open at 11 on Sundays and I would have only had like a half an hour there. And Minneapolis is a great theater town. Minneapolis is second only to New York City in terms of theater seats per capita. It's also home to some of the best regional theaters in the USA. Here we play the historic Orpheum Theater. Built in 1921, this theater cost one million dollars to build. Over the years, some incredible musicals have had their premieres here, including Victor Victoria and The Lion King. Maybe you've heard of it. Also, fun fact, the theater was once owned by Robert and David Zimmerman. You may not know those names off the top of your head, but Robert Zimmerman often goes by the name Bob Dylan. You probably know that one. This incredible theater seats just under 2600 and has a pretty narrow depth, so even the nosebleed section is only 130 feet away from the stage. See, they had to do that back in the 20s when the theater was built because there were no microphones used at that time. Justice today is Carlina Parker. Get it, get it. Work that newspaper, or not newspaper map. It's a map. She's a tourist, <laughs> but she's gonna be justice. It was so great to play Minneapolis. I got to see some family that I hadn't seen in years, some of whom I'd never actually met. We met up with the Westerholms. Matthew was my piano teacher and mentor in college, and him and Lisa did our premarital counseling when Ginny and I got married. We met up with our friends Benji, Danielle, and Natasha. I did theater with Benji back in Grand Rapids, but they live here now. I saw my friend Sarah and her boyfriend Doug. I met Sarah doing Million Dollar Quartet at Mountain Playhouse in Pennsylvania, and we're doing it again this summer. And I got to spend time and do a little Q&A with my college professor, Jennifer Hunter, and her students at Northwestern University. I also met two very big fans of Rock of Ages. Their names are Henry and Will, and they have been looking forward to this show for 14 months. So I got to take them backstage and give them a little tour. Hi guys, if you've never been to Minneapolis, you've gotta come check it out. But if you're not game for some serious cold weather, I would recommend you do it in the summer. <laughs> Next stop, Fairfield, Iowa. It's a really good show, you should watch it. <laughs> Thanks so much for coming out, chase your dreams, and Cheers!